Hello friends welcome to our channel in this video we are going to discuss the remaining governor generals of india till now we have discussed lord william bentinck Ch sir charles metcalf and lord auckland spirits i am just discussing the important event took place during the period okay so the first one is the lord Edinburgh, whose period is from 1842 to 1844, he brought to an end the Afghan War of 1842. He also abolished the slavery system. Uh, Sindh was annexed by Charles Napier during his period, and the Charles Napier was appointed as a first governor of Sindh. Okay, now let us discuss about Lord Hardinge, whose period is from 1844 to 1848. First Anglo-Sikh War and the Treaty of Lahore. happened during his period this is this is only important event took place during lord hardinge's period so this much only important as a upsc prelim point of view now let us discuss about lord dolhousie period whose period is from 1848 to 1856 second anglo sikh war of 1848 to 1849 an annexation of punjab happened during his period abolition of titles and pensions uh, he abolished the title and pensions also Video Remarriage Act of 1856 passed during his period. Introduction of Doctrine of Lapse. This is very important. Just go through this. What is this Doctrine of Lapse? Okay. Uh, so this is uh, important as a UPSC mains point of view. Woods Educational Dispatch of 1854. Introduction of a railways, telegraph, and postal system in 1853. establishment of a separate pwd department that is public works department in every province an engineering college at was established at rorki plan to open universities on a model of universities of london in calcutta mumbai and madras second anglo burmese war of 1852 santal uprising of 1855 to 1856 and passing up of charter act of 1853 happened during Lord Dalhousie's period from 1848 to 1856. So we have covered all the governor generals and the important event took place during their period. So uh, from uh, next video we are going to start the viceroys of India. This is also important as a UPSC prelim point of view. So we have covered governor generals of Bengal. After that we have covered governor generals of India. Now from uh, next uh, series. Uh, next video series we are going to start the voice rise of india so this is for today thank you